from the other day. I do have a story. Why don't you briefly read it for anybody that doesn't know the story okay. of Happy the Clown oh, sad story. as we prepare our tribute. Melvin Hall is his name. He started performing in his father's Wild West show before the Great Depression and never strayed far from an audience. The 84-year-old... <laughs> I'm trying to do this with some class, do you mind? The 84-year-old, <laughs> known as Happy the Clown to the children and senior citizens, whom he still performed, died Tuesday morning in a fire at his trailer home in southeast Dallas <laughs> County near Balk Springs. His daughter, Carmen Hall, said her father never knew any other life than performing. Mr. Hall's Boston, ter- <laughs> Boston Terrier named Dog was <laughs> probably also killed by the fire. No foul play was expected. Was suspected. <laughs> <laughs> that's about all. That's about all I need to read. <laughs> I tried so hard. <laughs> okay. All right. And we thought, because this was such a horrible thing to happen, we should have a little memorial service for Happy the Clown. Are you guys ready? Oh, yes. Quit it, Eddie. I can't can't get started. (laughs) Friends and neighbors. We are here today to pay tribute to the remains of a man who entertained us for many years. Can I get an amen? Amen. We are here today to say goodbye Goodbye. to Happy the Clown. (laughs) Happy love, children. He entertained all the way to his untimely combustion. For you see, he was at a birthday party when his clown suit caught fire. It was a it was to be a joyous time for the children's. Oh the children's just love the clowns. They had a large cake, presents, a clown. And a donkey for rides inside the spacious double white mobile home. Oh, I bet Mama loved that donkey. I'm sure it'll take many years for the children to forget the image of happy bursting in the pool. the organist start again. <laughs> Many years for the image of happy bursting into flames. I'm sure it'll also take many years to forget the image of him running in circles. <laughs> The crappy three and a half hours was worth it. Here's the warm up. Let me back up a little bit. Take a deep breath, right? I'm sure it'll take many years to forget the image of him running in circles, screaming, My legs, my legs, I can't feel my legs. Start again. Thank you. I'm sure it will also take many years to forget the image of Happy running straight into the wall. (laughs) Over and over to try and put himself out. We're not going to make this. We're not going to be done by seven. <laughs>
<laughs> Just memorial. <laughs> <sighs> I'm sure the children will also never forget the final moments as the donkey trampled happy <laughs> trying to get away from the flames. I guess it was just time for Happy to come home and the Lord wanted to make sure he left a mark. <laughs> Okay, I remember that. That's where we were. Carpet. <laughs> Carpet. <laughs> and the wallpaper. <laughs> can, we, can we start again? <laughs> <laughs> we never know how the Lord plans things. Sometimes people pass away in their sleep. Very restful, very peaceful. Sometimes they get barbecued. <clears throat> now, you see, I wasn't at the party, but witnesses say Happy made them laugh until the very end. <laughs> you see, he kept shoving his entire head into the cake in hopes to try and extinguish the flames. <laughs> then, to the children's joy, he fell forwards and his head lodged into the anus of the riding donkey. <laughs> While still on fire, Happy was dragged to the mall. <laughs> <laughs> Happy was dragged through the mobile home. Where'd that leave off? <laughs> he has his head up the donkey's butt. Thank you. <laughs> Dragged through the mobile home by the frightened animal. <laughs> Luckily, one of his oversized clown shoes <laughs> got caught in one of the children's big wheels. Oh, Lord, the big wheel. As the donkey dragged the flaming entertainer through the home for the fifth time, the big wheel lodged behind the TV set and popped happy out of the animal's ears. <laughs> oh, happy. Unfortunately, happy being blinded by birthday cake and donkey fecal matter. He stumbled into a natural gas space heater. <laughs> oh, please. <clears throat> we are almost there. <laughs> Where was I? Oh yeah, the space heater. <laughs> Well, the space heater was leaking gas and was ignited by a happy suit, <laughs> which had now melted onto his body. <laughs> happy was blown. <laughs> <laughs> Almost there. Oh, so close. We, ain't, we, so we close. ain't two sentences away. <laughs> Happy was blown through the back window of the home from the explosion. But he landed safely into the family's above ground swimming pool. Oh, thank the Lord. Unfortunately, the pool has been empty for six years <laughs> and had been used to store cleaning materials. <laughs> It was said to be a can of Homer Formby's furniture cleaning polish <laughs> that fed the already out of control flames <laughs> that finally took Happy to meet his maker. <laughs> Sometimes the Lord works in mysterious ways. <laughs> but I'll be God if I can figure this one out. <laughs>